Mika and Rick, the charge is called honest services wire fraud. And the U.S. Attorney Office announced today, right here, that former state senator J Jamie Kalani English and former representative Ty Cullen defrauded the people of Hawaii of, quote, honest and faithful services. They allegedly used their influence improperly and accepted money to do so. The U.S. attorney, Claire Connors, announced that a contractor that worked regularly for the county, known as Person A, sought advantages for their business, and that the two former lawmakers accepted bribes to support Person A's interests legislatively. The federal attorneys also stated that these are not indictment charges, but felony information charges, which suggests that they are not going in front of a grand jury and not currently being contested by the defendants. Mr. English received from Person A uh, different financial gifts in the form of hotel rooms in Las Vegas, in the form of meals that were provided by Person A. In one case, Person A asked that Mr. English introduce legislation involving cesspools. He agreed to do so, and he received $1,000 from Person A. In another instance, as the legislative session continued in 2020, Person A then asked Senator English at the time to kill that legislative action. And he received $10,000 from person A to do so. The information charges that Ty Cullen also interacted with person A back in 2014, accepting bribes in the form of cash and casino chips. The indictment describes person A as running an industrial business well positioned to avail itself of publicly financed cesspool conversion projects, as this company was one of the few companies that could do the specialized work in the field. The U.S. Attorney's Office also says that violation of this statute could lead to a penalty of up to 20 years in prison. Reporting live, Jeremy Lee, KITV4 Island News. Jeremy, thank you. Representative Ty Cullen resigned this afternoon. Well, Kalani English announced his resignation from the Senate last April, citing long-term health conditions from COVID-19. Both were, in, were uh, very powerful positions in the state legislature. English served as Senate Majority Leader from 2015 until his resignation. He's from Hana, Maui, and started serving in the Senate in 2001. English represented District 7, which includes Hana, East and Upcountry Maui, as well as Lanai, Molokai, and Koholawe. His attorney, Richard Singh, said in a statement, quote, Kalani is extremely remorseful and deeply sorry for his actions. He has cooperated fully with the federal government and will be taking formal, formal responsibility in the form of a guilty plea to be, to be completed in the coming days.